Hey everyone, welcome back to Pop Draw, and today I'm going to be showing you how to draw Bullseye, the target dog, based on this Funko Pop design. So, I'm going to get started here by going towards the middle of my paper, and I'm going to draw a line that kind of curves around like that. And then, uh, where I ended that line, I'm going to curve it back around and come back to where I started. And then I'm going to come to this point right here, and I'm going to bring this line up and around to about right here. Bring this around. And then at this point, I'm going to draw a line that kind of forms like an S line for his ear right here. Then I'll bring this line to a curve at the top here and then bring it back down right here. And then I'm going to connect this line right here to this line right here by drawing a curved line between the two. Okay, now I'm going to come over to this other side over here and I'm going to draw his nose. So this is going to be a line that starts curving out about right here. And then it's going to come around and back to where we started. Kind of forms like this round shape here. And then we're going to come off the nose and draw a short line from about here to here. And we're going to stop it about right there to draw a curved line that kind of indents inward. And that's where his eye is going to go. We'll come back to that later. And then I'll start curving this line up to about right here. And we'll stop it there again to draw his other ear. So this one's going to stick kind of like straight up right here. And then we'll curve it at the top. And bring it down about right here. And then we'll connect the end of where we drew this ear back to where we started drawing it. And then I'll just connect these two lines together across the top. And then some details inside the ears. We're going to draw a line on the left ear that curves up and comes to the corner right there. And then on this one, we're going to do that, but a little bit wider. We're going to start about right here and then draw a line to the corner. And then for his eyes, we're going to come over to where we started drawing this one, and we're just going to draw a curved line that comes back through there, like that. We can go ahead and fill that in right now if we want. I'll draw a little bit of reflection there. Fill that in. And then his other eye is going to be more like an oval shape. We usually draw the eye as like a circle, but his head is kind of like tilted this way a little bit. So it's going to be more of an oval shape. And then I'll draw a little bit of reflection in that eye. And then I'll go ahead and fill that in. Now I'm going to come down back to where we started at the collar here. And I'm going to draw a curved line that starts about right here and comes down to about right here. And I'll do the same thing over on the left side. And now in between those lines, I'm going to draw a curved kind of U-shape right here. And then I'll draw a line off that side on the right. And we're going to curve it around, kind of like a hook here. And that's where his first toe, we're drawing his feet right now. So then I'm going to go over to the left side, and I'll do that again with the line that comes down. And then hook it around right there. And then I'll draw two more of those lines next to that. One more right here. And then this last one's going to come up and curve around and then connect to this line that we drew on the outside. And I'll do that on the right side too. A curved line here. And that last curved line that connects right there. Okay, so now in between his legs, we're going to draw 
his body kind of in between there. So we're going to draw a curved line right here. And then I'll add one little line right here. That's for his back foot kind of poking out through his legs here. And then his other leg is going to be over on this side. I'm going to draw a curved line right here. And then one more curved line right next to that for his foot on this side. So now the last thing I'm going to do is draw the target symbol on his head. So I'm going to actually use a red marker for this. And you're probably doing this in pencil, so you can just kind of outline the shape that I'm going to draw. But I'm doing this in Sharpie, so I'm going to use this red marker to go around the edge. So first I'm just going to draw a circle around the edge here. Like I said, you can just outline this if you're doing it in pencil. Or you can do it in a red marker if you have one. There's the outline for his head. And then I'm going to do one more big shape around the edge and to finish off that symbol there. So I'm just going to start by drawing a line that kind of goes all the way around. The circle shape there. And then I'll kind of even this out by thickening it up on the edges. Last thing I'm going to do is just fill in his nose right here. And I'll add a little bit of reflection on that too. And then I'll color in his collar too. And normally I would do a time lapse of me coloring it, but there's not much to color on him. So I'm just going to leave it how it is right now. And Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below what you want me to draw next. Thanks for watching.